Hi, this is Daniel Royal Legacy, on behalf of Novica, inviting you to join me as we explore the mystique of the Cool Garden Blouse. Why is this blouse so mystical? From afar, the Cool Garden Blouse by Ritu Agnihotri has the appearance of a lovely light green, but on closer inspection you will find that the fabric of the blouse was actually woven of yellow and blue threads. From afar, your eyes perceive green, yet up close you readily make out the variations. Along with the beauty of the fabric, there is a delightful floral garden that was created in shimmering silk embroidery. This engaging garden flows around the neck of the blouse and the cuffs of the three-quarter length sleeves. There are beautiful blossoms of ruby red, amethyst, and small white flowers that remind me so much of one of our own local wildflowers, the Desert Star. My daughter chose this blouse as she loved the sweet, refreshing look that Ritu created. This graceful blouse feature slits on each side of the bottom hem for an easy fit. When wearing the blouse, my daughter likes to wear it with jeans, either blue or black. She wears it when she goes out to shop or when she steps out with friends. The cool garden blouse also looks fantastic with her long black skirt for church for a more dressier appearance. Whichever way she wears it, it makes her look so lovely. Now, when you receive this blouse in the mail, it does come to you in a small bundle wrapped in tissue paper. When you unfold it, you will find that it is wrinkled and needs to be ironing before you wear it. Because it is made of 100% cotton, you will need a hot iron, but take great care of the silk embroidery. Being an avid embroiderer for years, here's how I iron the embroidery of the blouse to take out the wrinkles. On the ironing board, place a soft terry towel. Next, turn the cool garden blouse inside out and place the embroidery that is inside out on top of the terry towel. Now place another light towel, such as a flower sack towel, over the embroidery and iron with a medium to hot iron. When ironing this way, you will not flatten the embroidery, nor will you accidentally burn the silk. Even though it does say that you can machine wash the blouse, my daughter prefers to hand wash it in cold water, then hangs to dry, as she does want to keep the embroidery looking its best. My daughter is very delighted with this eye-catching botanical blouse with its mystical fabric by Ritu Agni Hotri. Ritu is a sketcher and painter. She could be considered one of the pioneers of the fashion industry when it was new in India. She specializes in designs that feature a blend of embroidered work with strong print lines. She loves to use traditional motifs from different regions of India, yet gives them her own different twist to the patterns. Ritu puts so much passion into her work, and the cool garden blouse truly symbolizes her artistry. I must say that the cool garden blouse does have such a mystical quality about it, and at the same time captures the beauty of a refreshing garden. It certainly is a treasure found at Novica. Thanks so much for listening.